Hello, I'm Mark Gonnerman, Founding Director of the Aurora Forum here at Stanford University. And again, we're collaborating with Stanford Lively Arts. This fall, we're introducing a new program, the Stanford Lively Arts Aurora Forum Jazz Book Club, which will be hosted by Lisa Mezzacapa and Matt Campbell. I'm Lisa Mezzacapa, and I manage the campus programming at Stanford Lively Arts. And uh, I'm also a jazz bassist, and so this year's uh, programming theme, Remember Mingus, has a lot of resonance for me, and I'm excited to say that we will be talking about jazz autobiography this year in the book club, and actually beginning the series with Charles Mingus's Beneath the Underdog. And I'm Matt Campbell, Director of External Relations here at Stanford, Live the Arts, and uh, I'm really glad we've picked this this book as our as our uh, first foray into uh, the jazz book club. It's a really, really exciting memoir. It, the book just races along. Mingus treats his life story like it's one of his compositions. He he riffs on it. He blurs the lines between facts and fact and fiction. Um, there's just a, a tremendous amount of, of interesting material about his upbringing in Watts, um, his life on the road, including some uh, his, his lifelong relationship with Fats Navarro, uh, his time in Bellevue. There's a little bit of everything in here. Uh, one little disclaimer, it gets a bit racy at times. Um, a lot of that is in the first chapter, so uh, as long as you're not put off by that, I think you're going to enjoy the book, and I hope you'll join us. And a nice thing about uh, starting with Mingus is um, he has a very particular way of telling his personal story and framing how he wants the world to see him. Um, and I think in subsequent autobiographies, like the ones by Duke Ellington and Miles Davis that we'll read in the book club later this year, you'll see a really different perspective on how the artist decides to um, write about themselves and write about the people that they interact with and just being a jazz musician in the world. And so I think it'll be a lot of fun to see the really stark contrast in some of those. Yeah, this will be great. So get the book, start reading, and join us on November 13th at 6.30 in the Coho, the coffee house across from Dinkelspiel Auditorium. And this reading group will meet just before the Christian McBride performance that evening. So we look forward to seeing you then.